The MP for Wokingham insists leaving the EU on March 29 remains the best course of action for both sides, as it would set the ball running in order to strike a free trade agreement with Brussels. Mr. Redwood wrote on Twitter, I see no reason for a delay in Brexit. The EU has always said we can't negotiate a trade deal with them until we've left. That is why the best course of action for both sides is for the UK to leave on the 29th of March but both to immediately enter serious talks about a free trade deal. The Tory backbencher maintains any potential delay will create further uncertainty for people and businesses across the country. He added, leaving now would allow both sides to carry on with their imposing tariffs of the FDA. A long delay with us still in the EU would put off any negotiation of our future trading relationship, adding to business uncertainty. Leave the EU in the scheduled 12 days time after MPs emphatically passed a motion, although not legally binding, to reject leaving without a deal. Brexit News. John Redwood has warned against an extension to Article 50. Image Getty, Mr. Redwood also hit out at Remainers who are looking to thwart the will of the 17.4 million people who voted for Brexit in the 2016 referendum. He said, Remain appeals to democracy whilst disagreeing with its findings. Remain loves democracy only when the vote goes their way. Theresa May is set to hold a third meaningful vote in the Commons. This week despite suffering a defeat by 149 votes just five days ago. Brexit News. Theresa May is set to hold a third meaningful vote in the Commons this week. Image PA. However no business motion is yet to be announced. In Parliament, and senior cabinet members have today said the vote may not even go ahead. Chancellor Philip Hammond stated, the vote is not definitely going to be this week, whilst International Trade Secretary said the vote will be determined by whether we can succeed in getting that vote through the House of Commons, should the Mrs May overturn to if the biggest government defeats in history and get her deal through the Commons at the third attempt, she will inform Brussels of the UK's intention to seek a shorter extension to Article 50 when she meets EU leaders in Brussels on Thursday.